morning. Thank you very much for all your effort and yourself and your staff onto the PSNI for the effort in getting us to this stage of the count and to the speedy, well, not so speedy conclusion and that we were left to the last. But anyway, uh, the efficiency and effectiveness in which the count was conducted. Uh, I know that I'm standing between you and your bed, so I'm going to be brief. Fighting any election is not an easy task, and I acknowledge the efforts made by all my opponents in this election. And all of us have the best interests of South Belfast at heart. And I will work alongside all and everyone who genuinely strives to make life better for the people in this constituency and beyond. I am proud and honoured and humbled that the people of South Belfast have once again put their trust in me and in the SDLP to represent their interests at Westminster and on the ground. So I want to thank each and every person out there who has voted for me today. These people come from right across the constituency of South Belfast and I take pride in the fact that they reflect all shades of identity and every social class in this city. Over the next five years, I will willingly carry the hopes and the aspirations of all the people of South Belfast as I represent them in Westminster and on the ground. I find it difficult to find adequate words to fully express my appreciation for the support and the friendship of my colleagues, my family, and the scores of SDLP activists who have worked with me in this campaign. But I am delighted that as results of the election come in, that my colleagues Mark Birkin and Margaret Ritchie are where our Mark was already elected and I haven't quite heard the results from South Down, but I know Margaret will be returned in that constituency. I know, that, I know that Justin McNulty is highly competitive and Yuri and our man, I await the results there with a degree of anticipation. There are others right across the North, colleagues in the SDLP have done well. Together we will continue to be representatives for our constituencies and for Northern Ireland as a whole. My colleagues right across the North have put in a huge effort and I thank them and their supporters for the endeavour and wish them success as figures come in and results are declared. The incoming parliamentary term will be a crucial one, which will have a significant impact on everyone in Northern Ireland. And I will, alongside my colleagues, face the challenges that are out there, both in the Commons, in the Assembly, and on the ground. As results come in from England, I know they're changing, but I understand it may be a Conservative government the SDLP remains committed to opposing the Tory agenda and ensuring that we get the best possible deal for Northern Ireland. Other parties must now think carefully about who they will back in the coming days as a government is established. But I appreciate this opportunity once again to continue my work for the people of South Belfast and I thank them one and all for their support. And thank you. Yeah.